I had the belief system that I was an object um, and that I was just there for men's pleasure because in pornography, women are treated like animals. But my senior year of high school, um, I got into an abusive relationship. And the first time I ever hung out with this guy, I was assaulted um, and I didn't consent. And I remember coming home after that and being in my room, shaking and crying and like torn up and thinking to myself, well, I probably should have consented because this is what porn is. And so it shaped everything for me. And I was in that abusive relationship for over a year, um, was assaulted multiple times. And I was in this like weird, like limbo of like, I don't like that at all. <laughs> like, this is not fun for me. I'm hurting emotionally, physically, mentally. And like, I know he watched porn too. So it was like, we were recreating porn together that wasn't consensual, but I was like, I should be consenting. This should be what I want. So this whole abusive relationship was wrapped in porn. My entire identity and who I believed I was as a, as a woman was wrapped up in porn. And it was this like really sad and heartbreaking, like back and forth where I was like, I know who I want to be. I know what my heart wants, but what I've been raised to believe because of pornography is not adding up. And it was really painful and it was really difficult and it was really degrading for me as a woman. So I graduated high school and I moved to go to college and the college that I went to, you did title nine training, which is like sexual assault awareness and all of that stuff. And yeah. that's when it clicked for me that I was in an abusive relationship. And once I came to terms that I was being abused, um, that's when I was like, okay, like I, I can't do this anymore. Like I was already yeah. like struggling so much because I had tried to quit porn off and on my whole life. And so when I came to terms that I was in an abusive relationship, that for me, I was like, I just can't because pornography is so violent. And what I experienced was so violent. It almost was like, I felt numb because what had happened to me was so violent and so painful, but I was watching things that were so violent and so painful. And the moment where it quote unquote in porn proceeded to enjoy it. They looked, it looked like they were enjoying it. So then I felt like I should have enjoyed it. Um, so once I, once it clicked for me that my feelings of not enjoying it were valid, that's when I was able to move forward and get out and getting in counseling and therapy is amazing. And having good friends was really helpful for me as well. 